this moves us into the question of how do we maintain our good position of the pelvis and be able to move and run and do all the activities we want to do whilst maintaining excellent pelvic position. The first system that we come to is the lateral system. The lateral system is made up of the contralateral or the opposite glute medius and quadratus lumborum muscle as well as the adductors. The lateral system is responsible for being able to keep the pelvis even when standing on one leg. So in many exercises in the gym, when you are using one leg, such as in a stepping up onto a platform or lunging positions, you will have to use your lateral system to be able to keep that pelvis in a nice even position. So with the lateral system, if you are weak or dysfunctional in the lateral system, what you will see is an unevenness through the pelvis or an increased shift out to the side when you're standing on one leg or you might see the opposite part of the pelvis dip down or hitch up, depending on if an overactivity in the quadratus lumborum muscle is present or a weakness in the glute medius and minimus muscles are present. There's some tests and assessments that we can do to be able to assess this, and these are such dynamic tests such as the single leg standing, the single knee bending test, or a single hop test or a single leg calf rise test. These are assessments that we'll look at a bit later on within the course. So the lateral system is really important for that symmetry of the pelvis when people are walking and moving, particularly when they're on one leg. 